Hi Cancer, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to Reading Cell. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading. I know now is an A forever. Okay, for Cancer, please. Please for message for Cancer's love situation for Cancer. So at the bottom of the deck we have the wheel of fortune beautiful so if things were stagnant between you and another person okay things might start moving as well someone feels like they could have missed an opportunity with you so they want a new cycle okay they want to enter a new cycle with you and to move things in a very positive way so let's see for the present situation we have the six of swords so someone might want to come towards common waters there's definitely there could be distance and someone wants to end this distance okay it could involve traveling to come and see you someone wants to make peace with you make commands why is the six of swords and the five of swords yeah i think that someone might want to end the conflicts if there's arguments if you two are not on the same page i think your person wants to make definitely amends here big time they want things to change between you two into something negative to positive okay why is the five of swords here in the king of pentacles taurus virgo capricorn so your person could have matured leveled up someone who you know has a different view now of the situation yeah Someone here wants to be a good partner for you and wants to make a man. So let's see for the blocker potential. The Page of Swords. Someone's spying on you. Someone's gaining information about you before they make that move. Yeah. They don't want to look bad or something. But if you are in communication as well, they might act as if, you know, they're very detached, as if they didn't care. Maybe you feel like the communication is very immature, emotionless. But this person definitely has a lot of love. Why is the Page of Swords here? And the Two of Wands. This person has a high focus on you. Let me tell you that. Two of Wands and Page of Swords. Spying. Wherever they are. So there's this distance, right? <clears throat> they don't like it. They don't like to be out of distance here. And they're very unhappy. They're actually very unhappy. The Two of Wands. It's a card of unhappiness. They're not happy where they are. And the whole time they're spying on you and they just want to move towards you. Why is the two of wands? And the two of swords. Yeah, your person is definitely at a crossroads. And knowing that wherever they are, they're not happy. They could be confused. Okay. There could be a level of confusion. They need to make a decision here. Definitely. But they could be spying on you to gain information. So maybe, yeah, they don't know if you're single or not. They don't know what's going on with you. They're trying to gain information before, you know, coming towards you. So let's see for the recent past. The Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Okay, so this is you, right? Very loving, very giving, right? Open to this connection. Very devoted. Why is it? queen of cups why is the queen of cups here the four of cups yeah i think your person here was not looking at what you were offering to them right they were looking at other things other cups and so yeah someone now feels like they missed an opportunity now they're very unhappy that they made a wrong decision yeah two of swords definitely this king of pentacles comes across as someone here who makes bad decisions bad judgment right and definitely missed that opportunity with you why is the four of cups here why is the four of cups and the knight of wands because someone was a player here so someone was you know playing around fooling around in and out unreliable non-committal but there could have been a shift here right because someone's a king of pentacles now maybe now someone wants commitment and wants to settle down let's see for the focus for the focus the seven of swords this person's focusing on 
their own behavior. Interesting. That's in their focus here. They're aware of what they did. They're aware that they messed up. They are aware that, you know, the pain that they could have caused you. Where's the Seven of Swords here? Why is the Seven of Swords? The Ten of Swords. This person's definitely is aware. If your person, you know, because the Nine of Wands could be very selfish, right? Someone who didn't care about your feelings of what they did to you, it's in their focus big time now. They have a big awareness of what they did. Maybe now they could feel responsible for this ending. They could feel bad, right, for what they did, for mistreating you like this, that you didn't deserve it, because you're all about love, right? They were the ones who just not seeing you what it is that you were giving to them. Why is the Ten of Swords here? So that's why someone wants to make amends here, right? They want to end this. Yeah, someone feels very guilty here. Very guilty. And they really want to, to make peace with you. Why is the Ten of Swords? Why is the Ten of Swords? The Ace of Cups. Yeah, they want it back. They want, it's in their focus. What they missed here in the past with that Four of Cups, they want it back. They want a brand new beginning in love. So they want to like put the past behind, okay? And start new. So they want to, yeah, they want to correct things here. Let's see. They want to redeem themselves. That's what I wanted to say. They want to redeem themselves for the near future. The Empress. Yeah, they, they missed a big opportunity, right? Yeah, they missed someone that was very good, very loving. So the Empress with the Queen of Cups, you gave everything to this person. So why is the Empress here? the justice card yeah they want to make things right right they want to correct things they want to balance the situation out now they want to give you that ace of cups that cup of love right so could we do with the libra we have taurus here as well let's see for the justice card and the fool yeah they want a clean slate they want to put it behind and start new and come correct now do to you know give you what they did not give you in the past so could we do with an aries a fresh start let's see for the white chanel the queen of swords gemini libra or aquarius okay so you could have switched energies you were not you're not as giving right to this person anymore you could have moved on maybe some of you could have moved on or tried to move on but it could also be that you're angry at them, right? Have a lot of resentment. And maybe now they feel like it's hard to get to you in this energy. Why is the Queen of Swords here? The Nine of Cups. Well, you're definitely their wish fulfillment here. Yeah, you're definitely their wish fulfillment. So, but now I think maybe you're not in the same energy as before. You're not giving this person your attention as you used to, right? your love it could be very detached you could have given this person the cold shoulder but you know either way even if you are in this energy they still view you as the one right that hasn't changed so why is the nine of cups here why is the nine of cups the eight of wands and they want to come towards you yeah they want to take yeah there's gonna definitely gonna be movement here the Fool and the Eight of Wands. There's going to be movement towards you. Even though you might be guarded here. So let's see for the outcome. The Hangman. So someone's going to end this stagnation. So there was... Yeah, see, your person's not viewing things in the same way. They're not viewing you in the same way. Now they're viewing you as their Empress. The one and only, right? Their heart's desire. So why is the Hangman here? the six of cups they're thinking you are in their focus this person could be thinking about you 24 7 day and night right definitely and you know regretting what they did here so six of cups so reminiscing 
viewing things in a different way, viewing disconnections. So you're dealing with a soulmate here. Someone could be viewing you as their soulmate, okay? And so they want a reconciliation here with that Six of Cups. Why is the Six of Cups here? The Ace of Swords. They want to take action. So, yeah, your person wants a clean slate, big time. The Fool and the Ace of Swords. So, you see, because, you know, they, they were focusing on their behavior here, right? And what they did to you and how they treated you very badly here. And now, you know, they want to come clean. They want to clear the air. They wanted to admit, right, possibly to you that they made a mistake, what they did wrong. And so you're going to may have, like, a, an open and honest conversation here about what happened about this Ten of Swords, okay? They might want that with you. And, I mean, build, rebuild the trust. There could be trust issues. And they also want to be honest now right they don't want to lie to you anymore they don't want to be in this type of behavior sneaky behavior player energy they want to be authentic right they want to be transparent with you so they definitely want a clean slate here definitely and they want victory here so they want to ask you for reconciliation but they don't want to look bad they want victory ace of swords right so it's up to you cancer right if you trust this person right you have free will. So that's it. So I hope it resonated with you. I hope you enjoyed our reading. Take care.